Hello everybody, welcome to your Friday edition of the MCN. A bit of a quiet time in the community, but there's still things to talk about. Like Deadpool Spring Cleaning or the Gwenpool Bauble Blowout. Look, is there a chance this event comes back? We don't know. Uh, with the current event standing, I think we're like 20 days still until the end of the event. And of course, going into what was it, a quieter week, I would either say if Kaban were going to do something, like announce something, it might be today, the 19th of um, uh, of. of April, I've got a month we were in then. Uh, would it be the 26th? Mm, debatable because then we're going too close to the uh, end of the month and of course announcements for the next thing. But uh, with the length of time still for the month, you think that Caban might have something around the corner that everyone could have a slice of the pie uh, with kind of getting involved with. When the question was asked, like, is spring cleaning tomorrow? And this was on the 16th of April. Uh, <laughs> Were they going to see something like, oh, announcement on the 17th of April, which of course was two days ago. Uh, Kaban Mike said, da, 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 no. So, no. Uh, it doesn't mean to say like it's not coming back. Uh, because I would, if it was like, no, and we don't plan to bring the event back, then that if that was what the answer was, I'd feel like, oh no, it's not coming back. But just say, simply saying, no. So you're saying there's a chance. Uh, look, it'd be nice to see it come back, but as I said, if they come out and we're going to do like an announcement, they more than likely would run it like this. Announce today, or later on today, or tease starting today. Run for seven days, quite possibly, but there's still time, ladies and gentlemen. Do you think it's going to come back? Put it in the comments. The Discord promo code, yes. That's our next story we're going to talk about. Do you remember this? Over the last couple of days, I think it was Wednesday, it went all crazy and everyone was like, go over to the web store, put in welcome to the Discord. And of course you've got three weekly web store crystals. But um, look, if, it was low, if it's lower than Paragon, you're not really getting spicy things. Although, some people did get really spicy things. I got messaged by um, Smoover, who uh, picked up a 7 star, and I think some Paragon crystals. Which is pretty impressive. I think 7-star Nexus. It was pretty impressive to see that. So some people picked up some nice stuff. I think I actually got some units as well. That was nice. Uh, we've done a whole video on this one. So go and check that out on the channel. But the reason we're mentioning this again is that people had issues. Do bear in mind, a lot of it is cap sensitive. So uh, not Captain America sensitive, but cap cap lock sensitive so yeah well cap, cap sensitive so don't put capital w it's all lowercase and uh, of course don't put any spaces and anything like that but some people did have a problem not everybody but obviously some people and it's important you know people want to be able to access these particular lovely things and of course that's that looks correct the code looks correct that they're trying to put in obviously people are trying to be as helpful as possible uh, with the matter but yeah like people have got incorrect code not great to be honest what is the issue with that well try without space and in small letters and in large ones and manually type the copied uh, and everything just nothing but that's the thing isn't it but what's the deal with that well command mike said hey all we are working with xsolar who by by the way are the i don't know if that people operate the web store not operate the web store but kind of like well they could operate i, I don't know but it's like a source within it and to investigate why this isn't working once we figure that out we'll be sure uh, to make sh uh, sure to make sure anybody affected has an opportunity to claim the code so it may be a case they just run the code for a long longer length of time but of course communicate to i say this thread hopefully this thread to kind of let people know uh, what the crack is but that was as of the 17th um on the matter um spent three hours talking to x oh some people are doing it as well and uh, uh, xl today as a result the problem was not solved they said wait three days maybe everything will work out Exola. thing is command support are now looking like better in correspondence in comparison to Exola. just saying um but yeah that's what it's all about uh that this is annoying isn't it like uh, can you please try to write manually welcome to discord with all the capital letters don't put that don't put that. Why? Why are people doing that? Please use all capital. Is that the? Is it? What? Who's that? For, who's saying these things? That looks wrong. Anyway. Um, oh, that's even worse. This is correspondence with the Exola su support chat. What? <laughs> oh my word! So the X for those that aren't able to get the code at the moment, the X get code to work. The Exola 
people um, are giving the, out the wrong code. They, they're saying welcome to Discord with all capital letters. That's not good, is it? As I say, Kabam support looking like golden here compared to Exola's uh, support. Yeah, very weird, but um, of course that needs to be resolved. If we find out more, I'll let you know on the MCN on Monday. Okay, now onto an interesting topic. Are War Masteries bugged? So, uh, Matty Ice says, Myself and one other Alliance mate have both gotten wrecked this war because of parry stun expiring really early. Yes! No, I had this as well, but I had it with a Purgatory fight earlier today. And I noticed it on my Mastery Switch, which I switched my Masteries. I run as well, Max, uh, Max Parry and Stupefy. So... I was surprised that I then got, when when I had enough time, I thought I had enough time, I then got clapped by a, um, a special attack. So I think there is something there. I don't know if it's just war, but I don't know if it's something with the mastery. Uh, let's have a quick look um, at uh, this footage. Okay. Nothing just yet. Um, it's probably if we kind of go ahead a little bit. Uh, was there a big knockoff of health gone? Uh, probably uh, is that is that there where we see like a bit a bit of a bit of a thing with it? I'm just trying to get it into shop for the right moment. Yes, there we go. So this moment right here, um, it's a bit grainy. I don't know if we can get it to a higher. Sp oh yes, we can. We'll do, we can do high HD. Look at us, kind of like doing that. Okay, so this is like playback. We're going to play back at 0 0.25. Um, keep an eye on top. Um, I'll do an arrow for it. I, I, I'll do the arrow so you can kind of like look at it there. So in this moment, still under stun. Oh. <laughs> it's buffering. It's not me buffering. It's the thing buffering. Oh, that's just, that is just typical, isn't it? It's like, start buffering. Okay, now now we're non-buffering now. See, there. Like, it just kind of went off. Or if not, it's like, is it an animation issue for bulls, Bullseye? Tough one, isn't it? Because, like, at this moment in time, this the, the champion's in the animation. Is this an animation for a special attack, or is it to hit? It is a basic, isn't it? Um, if anything. But, yeah, it's like... Is it snap out the animation? I don't know. A lot of time you debate the extent of Kabam's, like what's going on behind the scenes, but it definitely looks like there is a slow movement. Ugh, buffering again. The champion is, uh, it's like your champion's always, I feel it's the times, your champion's always slow moving against the, the defender. The defender always seems to be faster than the attacker. I don't know why. But maybe this is an animation issue based on Bullseye. But I don't know if this is just this fight. If it's just this fight or this interaction. But as I said, I had it with Purgatory uh, earlier today. So, yeah. It, it, it's, it's very hard to say. Part of me feels like it's an animation issue. But I, as I had it today with Purgatory, it could be a mastery issue. Anyway. Uh, is your attack mastery loader active or are you using another one? Current active um, mastery. I have not set my alliance wars loadout, my defenders yet either. Mm. Interesting. So maybe that war could have defaulted a mastery that wasn't the correct mastery. Maybe. But then that's not correct because it should be under this player's main account. Yeah. Uh, my whole Battlegrounds experiencing this limber, stupefy interaction is most definitely bugged uh we all swap mastery loadouts etc but the issue still persists well the tough thing about that is that whether or not there's another mastery counteracting that and look here's the thing i get where people are coming from and i totally agree stuff like this is happening it's just that a lot of the time with kabam they want to know what's going on behind the scenes and, and you know there could be something behind the scenes like um uh, is it, no, it's not Petrify. What's the mastery that reduces down? Is it Pacify? When the opponent is inflicted with a stun debuff. Um, uh, Limba. Well, that's the thing. The, could you say that the enemy has, would the uh, defender have Limba on them at higher, higher rate or higher level? I don't know. It's it's a it's a written reaching really with that one because I do get where people are coming from in the community when they say about stuff like this. 
Night Zero says, I'm having the issue as well. At the same time, my dex isn't working properly as well. I'm not sure if that's the same issue, but evade normally um, specials in one random dex. I don't, I don't doubt it, but Kabam like it to keep on point. Okay, what else? All right, I'm chatting with the game team and we'll try and chase this down. Those having the issue, have you reset your mastery since we declared uh, we resolved the issue? We have one report of an account experiencing this issue and they hadn't reset after the key point resetting resolved this issue. Please try and let me know. Uh, yes, I've changed my loadout between uh, suicides and my main multiple times in the last five days. I've been on my main setup for the last two days. So there you go. That's That would kind of like pinpoint it being fine because that's when the fix came in like in the last couple of days i think uh, i changed loadout several times we started the game went back to war issue was still there defenders still i've still super limber uh, not good um switch them switch them back still issues the team is diving deeper into this issue i'll report back um if i have anything to share um Wait, Alliance Wars attack loadout? You mean simply the uh, basic loadout we are currently running in the... Uh, that may be called that right. The only game determined in Alliance Wars specific loadout should be the defensive ones. Of course, if that one is being uh, being applied to offense, it would explain why everyone is having these issues. So yeah, maybe it, it could be. It could be taking from different locations. It, it, as in, like, you could be getting a mastery setup that's incorrect taking as part of the loader i don't know I, this is this is on kabam to kind of like investigate what the crack is going on now i mean the one you're intending to use for alliance wars attack you can label it whatever you want you'd like basically i was asking do you have the loader equipped that you think you have equipped okay so it's like saying uh, i think i've got my um main one equipped but i might have my um you know double edge liquid courage Ouchie Boo Boo Mastery uh, set. Which the thing is, it's, it's difficult to say that because you know anybody that switched to that Mastery knows. I mean, like, you go into a battle and it's, oh yeah, I'm poisoned, I'm getting poisoned and I'm getting bled. I'm running that Mastery. Oh, I'm not getting those those effects at the start of the, the game unless they are double immunity champion or unless they're a purified champion. Uh, then you kind of like know to the you know contrary to that uh, particular belief. So it's all very interesting. Are you experiencing issues of this nature? Put it in the comments and go to the thread in the link in the description and uh, you know have you say with Kabam. And now onto an interesting little um, thread on um, something that we've we've talked about this in a long time. Uh, will the game will MCOC have a real time PvP? Of course, at the moment, like the game is not live or real time PvP. It's PvPVE with Battlegrounds um, and you're at the whim and mercy of well, AI. So no, it is what it is. But there is another person on the other side choosing champions. You've just got to swipe and tap and pick in a way that's going to be acceptable uh, or, or interesting. But look, like other games like Street Fighter, like uh, Tekken, like Mortal Kombat, live PvP is always um, is a lot of fun. Uh, especially because anything can really happen. So when the uh, when the question was posed to, um, to Kabam Mike, or posed in general, Kabam Mike did um, have a little bit of a response. Uh, I'm not sure. There's a lot of factors involved here, not least important of which is the technical limitations and technology. But over time, technology gets better and, and those limitations dwindle. There was a time when we couldn't imagine doing something as crazy as having Ghost Rider summon the motorcycle into the fight or make a character like Sandman, but those days are long ago now. The gameplay itself would need some work, unlike most fighting games, which are a mix of action and reaction. I think that MCC is much more based on reaction, and there would be a lot of waiting around for your opponent to dash in, so you could either try to block or intercept. I would imagine there would have there would be no masteries, at least no parry, a way to break block that is more reliable than a heavy attack, and the removal or adjustment of intercepts. Uh, so yeah, like that. I, I do think at some stage someone needs to make a good Marvel fighting game. Of course, DC had uh, DC Universe. I'm not saying like MCC is the answer because it's not on the same levels as as Mortal Kombat, as um, uh, yeah, some of the other mentioned Street Fighter and 
maybe the time is is now, and maybe Kaban missed the boat with it, especially when you get seeing Marvel Rivals going to close down for next month. Imagine if Kaban were kind of like building something that was not Marvel Contest of Champions 2, but something that was, I don't know, uh, Marvel Battle of Champions or something like that, or Marvel something of champions. Obviously, Marvel Rivals is taken, and Marvel Realm of Champions is is no more. Although I did like the concept of that. It's just a case of like Marvel Fight of Champions, the Fight of Champions, something like that. Marvel's Fight of Champions. There we go. We've just invented a new game. But I, I know I think the time is now to do stuff like that. Maybe look how Marvel Rivals performs and think about bringing out something that's different. But in any case. It's just sad we won't see it, but that's why it's better for a new game uh, at some stage. There's also some champions that would need to be reworked, like the already mentioned Hyperion or even Magic. And I suppose that's the thing. Your rotations will change how you play a champion in something like that. But uh, yeah, it'd be quite exciting. Especially with like how it's, it's maybe better for esports. I mean, look at the... Um, uh, what has it seen? Yeah, there's a, there's a good enough... like. Not a super thriving, but kind of a good enough esports scene around. I think it's Mortal Kombat and I think it's Tekken, but definitely the Smash Bros, like Super Smash Bros, which is not exactly. It's like multiverses, but it's set the standard. And because it's set the standard, like, could you see something like Marvel? Eh, we'll have to see. Spitting ideas there. I uh, I say we can't say never, but that would, uh, but there would be work that needs to be done. Yeah, I personally think. Just make a new game and then, you know, see if people want to play it. But in case, that has been the show for Friday. Thank you very much for watching. Check out some other content which will be located on screen right now. I'll see you all in the next video. Have a lovely day and weekend. Bye-bye.